Hello. And welcome to new video from Albion for solo players. First of all I'm sorry for not posting any video last week. I was too busy at my work. In few hours from now the new update will be released. I hope you guys feel exciting for this. Because this update will change the game completely and it will make huge impact for money making methods. Some will be more profit and some will be less. And I will test everything by myself before deliver it to you guys with live screen. So you can watch step by step. Today, I give you the fishing guide. This will be a little bit long video. But you can skip for any part you want to know more about it. From the timeline bar or time code in the description. Before we getting started with the video. I want to remind you about the giveaways we offer on every video we upload. To join in the giveaways. Like this video. Subscribe to the channel. And write your name in the game in the comments section below the video. The first one will write to us, will have 500,000 silver. The second one will get 250,000 silver. Third, fourth and fifth will get 100,000 silver. Thank you for support, it help us a lot. How to fish? Simply, grab your fishing gear. And go to any water in the map, in any zone. Move your mouse into the water. The arrow icon will turn into fishing hook icon. Click the mouse and hold it. The more you hold the farther the hook will go. Then wait a few second your fishing rod will hook a fish, now the mini game will appear. You need to let the fishing hook stays in the borders. It's very simple. There is two kind of fish you can get. The regular ones. And this can chopped in any butcher in any city. Or you can build a butcher in your own island. And this step is free and doesn't require any focus points. And will increase your estimated value. So by chopping your fish. You can make profit. And to go more farther. You can make fish sauce point one. Point two. Point three from any cooking vendor in any city. And this step also doesn't require silver or focus points. And this will increase your profit even more. All you need to do is getting the requirements to food station. Crafting the fish sauce requires chopped fish and the seaweed. And the seaweed is the most important item here. The second type of fish is the special fish. There are five kinds of zones in Albion Online. The forest, which is located in Limhurst. The swamps, which is located in Thetford. And these are the most richest two zone of fresh water areas. Bridgewatch, Fort Sterling and Martlock does not have large areas of water there. So my recommendation is always try to fish in Limhurst and Thetford. The water in the royal cities called fresh water. There is another kind of water which is salt water and this can be found in the ocean direction. This will be located in black zone tier 7 and tier 8. Or the place where you start the game near royal cities. You can fish sharks in black zones tier 8 or at the starting tutorials towns. Sharks used to craft shark trophy. It's very expensive also it's very dangerous to catch them in black zone because gankers hunts fishermen most of the time there. So the kinds of special fish you will get depends on where you are fishing. Because each environment have their own special fish. And here is the list of the special fish and what can be crafted by them. Okay guys. The boring part is finally over. And now let's talk about the fun part which will make millions of silver daily we will talk about fishing in yellow zones which will makes more than 1 million silver per hour and if you will craft food with your focus points you will make more but if you will craft in carolian you will make even more profit because of the return rate on crafting food there here is the simple steps 
Fish in yellow zone in Limhurst or Thetford. Chop your fish into chopped fish in any butcher vendor. Make fish sauce. With chopped fish and your seaweed you got. As a starter, sell you fish sauce. Point one, point two, point three. And your tier eight filled journals in the market. But if you have premium and have good specs in crafting, start crafting yourself using focus points. The more specs you have in crafting food, the more fish you can craft. And as you keep fishing, you have premium, you have island, you have good specs in crafting, you have maxed your fishing tree. Try to save 15 million silver and build one house tier 8 for fishermen. We will talk later on islands. Farming and journals in next videos. I know 15 million sound a lot but trust me. If your start get 4 fish in one cast, 15 millions means less than 10 hours. I will tell you now how I get my first premium and now I have more than 10 premium accounts. I was fishing 3 hours a day. Selling fish sauce 0.1 and 0.2 and my filled tier 8 journals. Then I got my premium and with my focus points I craft beef stew 8.1, then I get my first tier 8 house with 3 fishermen. I gave them my 3 journals, I fill every day in these 3 hours. They gave me special fish tier 7. And I started craft. Higher tier food. I bought another house and third house. And of course I will not fish 9 hours daily. So I start to buy them from the market by setting by orders and take them to Carolian and craft there. Then sell them back in other royal cities. Many people hate fishing because in late game you will not fishing that much. Well that's true. I don't fish right now. Simply because I make more than 2 million per hour. Now I have account can farm the ingredients of the special fish food. And I got my special fish from fisherman journals. And I have another account who have craft food. That's why I don't fish anymore. But without that early income as a solo player I couldn't reach where I stand right now. Finally some really useful tips for fishing. Make sure you are wearing the fishing gear. And always get fishing rod masterpiece quality. Or Avalonian fishing rod masterpiece if you can afford one. Which will gives your more fishing yield. From tier 6 or 7. You will start to get 4 fish from one cast. Also this depend how many specs do you have on fishing. Eat pork pie. Always get fishing bait tier 3. Or craft them. By setting by orders for earthworms. Get a good mount that have good weight capacity. Wild boar is good option. Or my favorite swap dragon tier 7. Don't chase fishing pools all the time. There is many other fish underneath the fishing pool. Especially if you are using fishing bait tier 3. It will takes 3 to 5 seconds and your hook will catch a fish. After 5 seconds just leave this means this place is out of fish. Chasing fish pools works well only in black zone. Or if you fish alone in yellow zone. Always use your learning points to level up your gathering fisherman node. Not fisherman specs. To hit tier 8 faster. You can eat fish early to hit tier 5 quickly. Each time you eat fish you gain fame. If you're our new player contact me in the game and I will give you fish worth 150,000 silver so you can eat them. Chop all the fish you got from yellow zone it doesn't worth crafting. Sometime it works but I prefer to chop them. Get your other tools for gather other resources on your way. Only the ones in your way. Don't distract yourself. When you almost saved the 15 million silver for your first tier 8 house. Start save your tier 8 filled journals. So you can give it to the fisherman later on. And for sure always have enough tier 8 journals with you. Try to open bank account in any zone that have storage post. 
so you can store your fighting gear and switch to fishing gear. Always flag to your faction. So whenever an event happens, you can go to your nearest storage post and change your gear and participate or go to the banded event. Then come back to fish. Well that's it for the fishing. Please let me know if you have any question. I would gladly answer it and discuss everything with you. Stay tuned for for the next video. It's a secret no one talks about. Most of player keeps it for themselves. So guys, don't miss it. Stay cool and see you after the update.